Hello and welcome back to Subnautica Below Zero. I'm Landsmaw Gaming, and last time we ended off a recording session. I got a lot of stuff done. Um, I'm gonna turn this down. I don't. Oh, that's still down where I put it. Damn, it's so loud. Um. So, in between episodes, I did a bit of stuff. That being just collecting stuff. And I set up, I reset up our storage system. I was tired of having a scrambled fucking mess. So here we are. We've got rare ores, which is all this shit, because I didn't have enough room for everything quite yet. And I've kind of just got everything reorganized. I've got signs going on, and I've got the bioreactor. I got some more fuel in this form of hoop fish. So that's all set up. And that's pretty much what I've done. I've also gotten a bunch of other ores. Um, I got a bunch of gold and silver so that we would be good to go come today and uh, I think we'll be alright I set this up because it wasn't it was fighting me to go where I wanted it so build this scanner room let's do it are you gonna change colors or are you gonna stay freaking white a scanner thank God will allow you to <laughs> survey the surrounding region for fragments and material resources like lithium or copper or titanium if you need help finding it for whatever reason what the thank you all right so we got the scanner room so it still has the same abilities or same upgrades man this thing's gonna be useless to me till I get magnetite son of a gun shoot I didn't even think about that. I don't have magnetite. Dang it. Well, we're not doing anything with the scanner room today then. Mess with it later. We have other things to do. While I was out gathering things, I learned of a few things I want to pick up. So we went ahead from the base south and two ticks to the east. Oh, so literally right here. Perfect. Um, and we need to head about 300 meters away from the base. And then down pretty deep. Because I came across a uh, data box that I really want. I think that's it right there. There's that, and there's someone over there, too. Let's check this first. What's this? This is just a PDA? It is a PDA. Cool. Hand it over. Alright. And now we'll come down here. And see what we can find. This made me angry. High capacity O2 tank. Hello! Asshole. New blueprint synthesized. And now that we're inside, Jesus. We can get the window. Stop! Go away! So, we learned how to make the high capacity O2 tank and how windows, which I didn't realize we didn't know how to make, but apparently we did not. So we are going to take this, head home, and make an O2 tank. Hopefully. We'll see. But I really wanted to show that off on, on the episode because I didn't want it to just be a... I, I found this off screen. I was trying to minimize what I did off screen without it as far as progression. So that's that we found that um, and I just did a bunch of collecting now we're here let's make an O2 tank I'm excited for that I really am tired of having only 75 oxygen it seems like they uh, they took out the uh, in-between step and that kind of sucked I hope I can make the high capacity tank I really hope I can make the high capacity tank What are you... 
What do you mean, ingredients unknown? I just picked it up! I'm so confused! What the fuck? Oh my god, it's the- I just learned the regular high capacity. I'm an idiot. Ignore me. It's still better than nothing, we're making it. Um, so I just need my standard O2 tank, two glass, four titanium, and a silver ore. I've got that easy. But I do need to take this off so I don't have to freaking get a new one. I just forgot what I said. Two glass, four titanium, two and a silver. Okay, we can do that. Where's quartz? Pick his quartz. There it is. One, two, three, four. And some titanium. There's four, I believe. Yeah. There we go. Back downstairs. Make some glass. You know what? I'll take it. They didn't get rid of the end between step. You just don't learn it immediately. But yeah, I've apparently lost my ability to read. But I'll take it. So this is going to give me some more oxygen. Thank God. One thirty-five. Way better. Way better. I will take it. Otherwise, we have a few things that we can head towards. I believe we have a few distressed. Oh, while I was also playing, the alien in our head gave us another uh, point to go to. So we're going to head towards that. Oh, I do want to. Whoops. I do want to uh, take a quick look at potentially making a sea truck attachment. I got to do this quick. Before I freeze. Um, I'd like to do the storage module. Man, my tip's going down quick. Uh, and a fabricator module. So I need two plate steel ingots, a computer chip, six lead, and a wiring kit. I think I have six lead? Welcome aboard, Captain. Yeah. Then I need two of these, and I need one of these, and I need two of these, and I need one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty of those rare ores. I need one, two, three, four, and then I need two copper. Yeah? Yeah. And then we start crafting. Copper wire. Computer chip. Wiring kit. Titanium ingots. Give them to me. They belong to me. Thank you much. Wait a minute. Are ingots cheaper now? Holy shit. In ingots are way cheaper now. What the fuck? They only cost five now? That shit's sick. Hell yes! Yeah! Alright. That'll save me a ton of time. Nice! Okay. Storage. No, come on. I want to... Drop it. I gotta craft the other one.
Okay. So now I'm gonna figure out how to hook up this one. Okay, that's cool. So we've got, what? Okay. So we've got a bit of storage in here, actually. Nice! Oh, hi. Okay. Alright. I like it. Nice. Alright. So we're all hooked up with a sea truck. I'm gonna go ahead and repair my uh, truck itself before I go anywhere. Okay, let's check it out. Oh, it also has a bit of storage. Nice! I like it. Let's cook some boomerang. Eat the boomerang. I need to get some water out of the base, and then we should be all set. Cool. Oh, also, oh, well, I can't, I can't do that yet. I was gonna be like, I was gonna say that I should make that hor horsepower upgrade, but uh, I don't have a moon pool. So, we'll have to find that later. Uh, water. Let's get a little bit more to take with me. Okay. And on the bright side with the sea truck, I don't need to, uh, I don't need to salt my food right now. Might as well grab these while I'm swimming by them. Since I have a fabricator with me. Sick. Okay, now where is that at? Ooh, it maneuvers weird now. That's okay. We're heading to the artifact. We're gonna see what there is to see. We can go pretty freaking deep, and we've got a good O2 tank, so that'll work that'll work I'm really curious to hear more from the uh, the precursor guy it's definitely interesting what's that sea truck part something. My bad. Gotta find a way down. Maybe it's like out and around? I don't think it's straight down in the cave. Eh, maybe it is though. I don't know. That seems like an awful lot. That's 300 meters down. I ain't going that way regardless. If that's the way I've got to go, then I've got to drop my shit and then go. So we're going to look around a bit more. Oh, yeah, yeah. Be quiet. You know what, let's venture out past where we've been. We got another kelp forest here. Not kelp, uh, creep, creep vine. So we've been here, this is the sea monkey hole. Okay. There's another titan hole fish. What are those? Those aren't 
Certainly not. I hope not. They aren't our angry friends. They're just, they're just jellyfish, right? Oh. Oh. Are you friendly? Can I, can I scan you? Hi, Jelly. Hello. Oh, I really don't like the fact that you're moving closer to me. Nope. We'll read up about you later. Is there anything cool going on down here? I'm glad they are not the freaking crab squids. Forget that noise. Forget the alien thing. We'll find it when we find it. We're going deep sea diving. Wow, uh, it's loading. Different. It's a different kind of place. Ow. I should have made some spare power cells now that I think about it. Granted, I guess I could just make them here <laughs> in the sea truck. It's probably not a bad idea, actually, if I come across this stuff. Okay, lights need to come on. It's getting deep and dark. Yo, that's a drop-off. Now, hold on. Something tells me this is the edge of the map. Okay. Learned that lesson last time. <laughs> and if I'm wrong, tell me in the comments. But that looks like the edge of the map. And that just sounds like a bad time to me. Like a bad freaking time. No thanks. What are you? Let me out, quick. Arrow ray. Scan him. Scan him. Discus. New creature fish. discovered. Are you different than the feather fish? You're a red feather fish. Nice. New creature discovered. These are cool. Back in the truck. Okay, I can see land down here. We'll go this way. Deep sea dot. Diving. Jesus Christ. The vent garden harvests geothermal energy to nurture the life that grows within. Can I go inside? It's so big. Massive. Yeah. 
Nope. Yeah, can't go in. That's upsetting. It's really cool, though. Huh. I'll get out of here. Rising temperature is detected in mineral rich fissure below. Ooh. Robin, I have something important to share. Another yes. artifact. Yes. Although... You cannot know for sure what it is, but it is certainly of significant import. Uh -oh. I know. Signal location uploaded to PDA. Okay. We may need to free dive. Also, free rubies. Ooh, what's that? Thermal plant. Hell yeah. Let's scan this ruby while we're here. There's rubies everywhere. Another site found. Ooh. Perhaps its data will tell me something useful. I gotta be quick. I have collected enough data to extrapolate the location of a component necessary to assemble my body. I will provide a signal. Signal location uploaded to PDA. Hmm. I gotta be quick. Okay. I already caught, got some uranite, so I'm not too worried about it. I just wanna get out. Alright, so we've got... Wait, why do we have three signals now? Answer. How do humans function with such a fallible and inferior body? Excuse you? My body is anything but inferior. I work hard for my body to be able to do what it does. Yes, but its overall form is not ideal. For example, consider its use of primitive ball and socket joints. Is there anything you don't find primitive? Humans bartered with evolution to get more brain wrinkles and opposable thumbs. It is true the opposable thumb is excellent. But all corporeal forms are temporary. The ability to be reborn when a body breaks down is correct. My body is my own and I cherish it. It grows with me. Humans have one life. We plant trees we can never experience the shade of. We build for the next generation. Noble, but again, truly inefficient. You are incredibly frustrating, you know that? I hope to see the forms of my people again. Hmm. Well, again, that seems like the edge of the world. What's that? Those are just rocks. Just rocks. I think that I want to try to make some new par or new power cells soon but I'm really curious about this stuff here's a chance to grab some copper while I'm here let's do that dang it 
That's more like it. Perfect. So we got enough to make one power cell so far. We just need to get the uh, the ribbon plants for it. Regardless, let's keep heading towards his body. Body cache? Or no, the artifact there. The body cache is down there. Let's head towards the body cache. Oh, you're glow whale. Okay, you definitely made me jump a little bit. <laughs> You are, uh, just large enough to be very concerning. All right. Let's see what we can find. I was really kind of hoping I could find, like, a uh, power cell charger. Fragment. Aquarium module, I already got that. Let's give another shot for some more copper. That's titanium. Copper. Titanium. Titanium. Negative. Well, let's head that way. Are these anything special? Or are they just glowy? They're probably just glowy. Got some shark friends, though. Oh, okay, I know where I am. Where'd the body fragment go? It's over here? For the body cache? Down there. I see. Well, we can head down that way. We certainly have the depth for it now. Thanks to our escapades. Ow. But after I check this out, I definitely need to go get power cells. For sure. Now, man, how am I supposed to go deeper? We'll look around. Now that we have air. Aha! This appears to be a way down. Excellent. Also... Things are huge. Shit. Keep crashing the sea truck. What? Surely this is not the end of the cave. Okay, I got a creature egg. I got two of them. All 
Alright. Well, I mean, that's actually pretty freaking upsetting. How do I get down? Like I'm so close. I guess I'm really not. I'm still 200 some meters away. What if I go this way? Where does that lead? Back into the room. Dang it. Hmm. Upsetting. Oh. Promising. Alien signpost. Better. Another alien signpost. Okay, we're on the right trail. I'm crashing into everything. Yes! Perfect. Out of the truck. Let's go. We got land. Dry. Surface. Ooh. Corpse. This skeleton is for me famous. Able to handle heavy forces. A good friend from my new form. Are you okay, Alan? It is not often that I gaze upon the form of a foreign architect. Is this place another sort of sanctuary? It's peaceful. Beautiful, even. As the bacterium spread, the continuation of life became uncertain. This is a place to reflect. I think I understand. Hmm. So what, we learn now that we can, do we learn? Okay, so I could make it. Interesting. Okay. Well, let's head home. And I will actually meet you guys there. All right, and we are home. So, first thing I want to do is just turn a lot of this crap into silicone rubber and lubricant. Just condense it down. Make it disappear. Then, I'm gonna put it away. Um, but I also wanna grab one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah. That'll be four powers, or no, that'll be, shoot, two of those to make one battery. That's two power cells. And miscellaneous here. Take some. Uh, where'd they go? One, two, three. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. There we go. Just like that.
We'll make some batteries. I definitely need to get some more ribbon plants. For sure. And then, in the future, hopefully we don't have to worry about the stuff as much. Oh wait, no, I can make the upgrades. You make them here now? Okay. So I could upgrade the horsepower if I want to. Oh yeah, because I made the depth module. Okay. Interesting. I was also told that the air bladder is a lot better than it was in the first game. Oh shit, yeah, I have the ability to make this, don't I? Yeah, let's make these. Alright, so I need two diamonds, a battery, titanium crystal, and sulfur. Silicone rubber and a bladder fish. Okay. Let's make them. Shit. Be right back. I gotta, gotta catch a bladder fish anyway, so... I also gotta find a ribbon plant. Okay. We're back. So, I got some extra ribbon plants as well. So then I'm just gonna need... Some diamonds. Shoot, I don't remember all the stuff that I need for the freaking laser cutter. I know I need crystal and sulfur. I can also make the propulsion cannon. I should probably make that as well. Okay, so I need titanium, crystal and sulfur, and a battery. I need silicone rubber. I need another battery and a wiring kit. Glad I grabbed extra. Um. There. Oh, I need that silicone rubber. There we go. Now we should be all set. Wiring kit. Battery. And battery. Tools. Air bladder. If you are dying, you're in the wood. Oxygen. The air bladder provides a significant upward thrust to help you get to air faster. <laughs> Needed one more titanium. And a laser cutter. There we go. Bingo. So we got all that stuff. I do want to try out this air bladder really quick. Oh. Interesting. So it'll give me a quick a quick burst upwards. How far how fast does it go? I swear this is the last thing. I should have ended the episode a while ago, but I'm curious. Nice! Okay, I like it. I like it a lot. That's cool. All right, sick. Let's go home. Let's go get in the house. Uh, let's plop in. We gotta switch out one of these. This one. There you go. That one's like half dead too. Jesus. Never ends. Also, give me all of this. I will put this shit away. In between episodes. But here, have this. Okay. Anyways. 
inside. Pause that. I want to listen to... Ah, jeez. These sea monkeys are going to get me in trouble. This is the third shipment that those buggers have gotten their weird little hands into. Now we're running low on flares, and I'm going to have to search nearby nests for stolen cargo. They're lucky they're kind of cute. Raccoons of the sea, those ones. This was just mean. From here. On my application, I mentioned I have a severe—I have severe galophobia, which is, wait for it, fear of sharks. So imagine my surprise when I discovered the brute sharks here. There's a reason they didn't call them gentle sharks. Anyway, the research outpost is half finished. I scraped my leg on a broken piece of coral. The blood drew a brute shark, and I couldn't build the rest fast enough. I used an air bladder to get to the surface. I dropped the builder tool inside the base. If anyone makes it down there, they can have it. Okay, so if I had read that there and I was looking for the base builder, I could have found it. Cool. All right, so I definitely need to start reading this stuff. And I was told by a comment that I need to, and I'm just dumb and I didn't. Um, to start reading this stuff while I'm there, like where I find it. So I can definitely start doing that. The docking module. No fucking way. This shit lets you attach a bronze suit. That's so fucking cool. Okay, hold up. So this collects fish? It's not like I have to put fish in it. It collects fish for me? That's pretty cool too. So just driving around gets you food. Nice! And we started to learn about the thermal plant. Alright. Well, I don't want to drag on too long with this. So I'm gonna head. I'm gonna go ahead. Call it there. That is gonna be it for this time, guys. If you enjoyed this episode, make sure you leave a like down below. Subscribe if you want to be notified when I upload in the future. We're looking forward to seeing more of this game. With all that said, have a good one, guys.